what's going on? I'm Todd Porter with uh, TP3M. Got my boy's car right here. We yeah. also built it a desert sand with high gloss metallic flake in it. Uh, we did the outside with the wheels to match. And then we also have the straps on there too as well. There's a lot more to come with this car. It is almost done. We gotta do the trunk setup and stay tuned. Tell the people where they can find you at, Mr. Pat. So you can find me on Instagram at TP3 Motorsports or you can, on Facebook. Or you can hit me up online or even uh, by Gmail just, or uh, Google. Uh, type us in at TP3Motorsports.com. Oh. Yes, sir. You've done your thing on this one, though, Tat. Yes, sir. Let's talk about this big dually truck over here for a second. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, check it out, check it out. So, All this right. is a gloss or a set? So this is a metallic black. Metallic black. This is a very, very hard color to get. Um, we had to wait six months for this color because it's always sold out. It's very, very hard color to get. Six months? Six months. So, and we have uh, four of these trucks to do. So, this is our first one that we're doing, and we're also doing the door jam as well. So, we have to take the doors off, take everything off. Uh, but we're, right now, we're just doing the outside. And then we'll take everything off tomorrow and do the inside. It's a big boy truck. You got to pay the play, baby. Pay the play. <laughs> pay the play. A big ram. Actually, the ram went into, they got away from Dodge and went into their own oh. manufacturing business. Yeah. So ram has its own logo now. Mm -hmm. So what year is this truck, man? Uh, this one is a 2020. 2020. Outrageous, man. It's nice. And we got other projects, but those are in the back half. Got a Jaguar, some other parts over there. Range Rover, a Porsche. Check out the big wheels. Yeah, this here be one of my dream trucks. <laughs> What's the price on one of these trucks? Uh, I think now they're over. Uh, like a couple of hundred thousand. Whoa. Okay, you got this Dodge Challenger out here. I think it's just a V6, 3.5. It's gonna be one of these bad boys. back outside yes sir wrapped by tp let me know what y'all think about this wrap man i went with a wrap i didn't want to paint it because i could take my wrap off and i still have my pearl white paint job ashanti's 24 it's a little bit the red trimming to match around the lights Yep, no floater caps. Daddy. Yes, sir. 442 gang. The 442 has finally came out the shop with the new Desert 10 wrap. Daddy, there's something open in the blue car. Dipping in the inside. I'm gonna check it out in a second. What's up, Just? Yes, sir. Let me know what y'all think about the big bold red color scheme I got going on. 
it's different, man. I've done it different because everybody has the outline around it. I wanted something different. Give people something different to look at. Yeah, you got the red top. Got the 411s in the back. Yeah, I just got it back today. I'm going to... Took the door panels off. Got to put the mirrors back on. Man, this thing is all dusty. Let that just top up. Yeah, sir, she goes up. Could be done. Yes, sir. Big rally strikes. Big, big, big. Everything big, man. Everything big in Texas. Man, I just want this to be motivation to everybody. If I can do it, you can do it. Everything is something nasty. A lot of hard work, man. Hard work and dedication. That's that desert tan. Then I go holler at TP. The man behind the rail. So you see now I done pulled the car underneath the garage. And now you can see all the flakes in it from the light. From inside the garage. So the red is definitely deep, like the top. It's kind of a little bit different. The top is a fire red. This is like a deep bold red. So you can't get that many options in the wrap. But this wrap is totally different, man. It's 2023. Nobody have this color wrap. Nobody have this desert tan wrap with the flakes in it. I haven't seen it yet. And this is why I chose this particular wrap, man. I was going to do the desert tan anyway. So, when they showed me this with all the sparkles and metallic, I just said it'd be something different. Like I say, I can always take it off and go back original to the pearl white. Or I can paint the car a different color, but I think I'm going to stick with this color because it's different. If you can see the little pearls, like it, it just gives it a whole different meaning, man. I like it personal to my taste. A lot of people might not like it, but I love it, man. You got to always try, be different. You can't have the same thing as everybody else and go with the same color. Like, just look at that red, man. It's... 
It's just different. It's bolder. It, to me, it makes a statement that this is a muscle car. 1972 muscle car. What's going on, buddy? Y'all done? Yes, because anyway, she has school tomorrow. Yeah, y'all got school in the morning. Yeah. All right, Justin. Goodbye, JJ. Hey, Justin. Hey, Justin. Oh, twist me. Y'all see it's all dusty, sis. Watch me. What's up, Jay? How'd you do that? Did you do this? Do what? Stuff? Yeah, on the windshield, I, I put wash me. But yeah, that rap is totally different, man. It's bold. It's bold, man. And it stands out with the hood scoops. Yes, sir. So I got to put all my mirrors back on. Yes, Small details is going to make it pop. Small details. I'm gonna make it pop. I gotta get my trunk done. Once our let is done, it'll be complete. This car got the 4L60E transmission, powered by the 60 LS swap with the four levers in the back. The whole drivetrain has been completely rebuilt, sitting on 24 inch. A Santi wheels with the convertible top with the red insides. Who opened the door? Like I said, I gotta I took this side off already because I gotta stick the mirrors on. I gotta put my piece in the middle. It's got the fire extinguisher. Just in case this baby catch a fire one day. Like I said, these cars are very hard to find. But I'm, I'm I think I'm gonna stick with this color though, man. I'm gonna make it grow on me. Landon, you like this color? I like it. I don't care what you say. I like it. It's different. Just look at the metallic flakes and the way that it has a, a slight tint coat to it. So when the sun hit it today, man, it was spectacular. You guys should have seen it. But that'll be on the next video. See, I gotta put my mirror right here. Gotta pull them out the box. I got all my chrome. Got that piece new for both sides. Corvette done. It's done it again. With the big 442 cutlass. The door's open. No, I think I locked it. No, it's open. You got to push it all the way. Like I said, the, the Chevelle will be out in about three more weeks. So, look out for it. I might put an LS swap mode in it. I don't know. The car runs perfect now. But look out for it. I'm going to end this video. Like, subscribe to the channel. And I appreciate it.